This is me, and these are real tigers. And today, I'm going to show you guys how I ended up feeding them. Anyway, a bit of context before we get to the tigers. Today, I'm at Safari World, Bangkok, a beautiful animal park in Thailand. Not only is there an animal safari, but there's also a marine park with this super cool river safari, which is actually the first thing we went on. The river safari showed the lives of the tribal people living in the jungle areas. They also showed the dangerous animals along the way. Although, personally, I felt as though if this ride was a bit too outdated. With the advanced technology these days, they could easily improve the ride. And who knows, maybe they could even incorporate AI into this new river safari. I'm not saying the ride was bad either. There were really some fun and scary moments in this ride, especially when we went through this tunnel. And I definitely did not get scared. Ah! <laughs> Why don't you guys just forget about that and look at this mammoth? Um, just forget that I absolutely screamed my lungs out in that tunnel. <laughs> Anyway, there were some more crocodiles and adventurers in the ride, but mainly other than that, that was pretty much it all. Anyway, by now we were pretty hungry, so I treated myself to a chocolate and vanilla two-tone soft serve. And the ice cream was not even that bad. My brother even liked his vanilla soft serve, and he doesn't usually like sweets. After we got our ice creams, we went to Open Air, which is basically an open air petting studio. It was here that my brother was finally reunited with his long lost brother. Wait, isn't that me? Anyway, forget about that because I got to do something even cooler. I got to feed milk to this baby tiger. How cute is this thing? Little did I know at the time that soon I would be feeding its older brothers and sisters. So stay tuned for that too. Meanwhile, my dad was holding this super cool and majestic looking brown owl. It was so well behaved, I couldn't believe it. The same couldn't be said for the owl my mom was holding though. It was a thousand times cuter, but it was so naughty and constantly looking up, plotting its escape. <laughs> Nevertheless, it was cute and reminded me of Hedwig from Harry Potter. And now, the moment we've all been waiting for, to feed the tigers. We all piled into these large metal reinforced vans with buckets of raw meat. And as gross as that sounds, that was basically the only things the tigers ate. Anyway, on the way to the tiger's habitat, we saw a countless number of giraffes and zebras. And although we certainly weren't expecting it, real lions. And finally, we arrived at the tiger habitat and to see these magnificent large West Bengal tigers surround our truck was truly magnificent. Most of the tigers got on the special plank which we could feed them from. The Bengal tigers were so huge that I didn't even expect them to be this large. But as terrifying as this looks, I gotta admit, it was really cute when the tigers picked up the raw meat from the end of our tongs. It reminded me of my pet dog Jasmine whenever I gave her a treat, which I guess is a bit unbelievable. Nevertheless, the tigers were really cute and I was sad when we finally ran out of meat. But it turns out the tigers still won't fall, so they kept surrounding us until it was time to leave. 
But if you guys thought we were only feeding the tigers, you guys are super wrong. Along with the tigers, we were also feeding these large wild hippos. The herd eagerly opened their mouths wide, awaiting our snacks. I tossed one this watermelon, but unfortunately, I have pretty bad aim, so I missed. Nevertheless, I kept trying until I finally got it right. After we treated the hippos with a few more vegetables and fruits, we got back in the truck. And on the way back, we saw these Himalayan black bears. They were also extremely big. But yeah, that's basically all we did that day. However, I have to admit, feeding the Bengal tigers was really cool and a once in a lifetime experience. And if you guys did like this video, a follow would be greatly appreciated. Till next time, it's Gautam signing off.